project, start construction, start fabrication, and, and start providing clean energy to Taiwan. Canada and Taiwan have a lot in common. We um, are two medium-sized countries that truly punch well above our weight and offer all of our citizens great opportunity and incredible freedom. So happy Canada Day. Woo! And our, our final speaker is our the Deputy Mayor of Taipei, Mrs. Vivian Huang. Come on up. So I am uh, uh, a very good afternoon to Chairman Clark, Representative Reeves, and Deputy Mr. Chen, and uh, everyone join us to, to here today. On behalf of Mayor Ke Wenzhe, and a citizen of Taipei. I would like to wish Canada happy 155th happy birthday. Mm. Okay. <laughs> so I'm honored to be a part of the Canada Day celebration and thankful to the Canadian Chamber of Commerce in tai Taiwan and Canadian Trade Office in Taipei for organizing this event. Canada Day is one of the largest foreign celebrations in Taiwan. And Taipei citizens like we so like like this festival. And after two years in which the event, this event was cancelled due to COVID-19, I feel hopeful and joyful seeing all people dressed in red and white. <laughs> and the color of the national flag of Canada building this place with passion, with friendliness, and resilience and energy. So finally, I wish you all good health and happiness and congratulations to everyone involved on the success of this event. Happy Canada Day. Thank you. Now we're going to cut the ceremonial cake.